I met this girl on the cruise ship while I was serving drinks, and we get kind of close, but just in a friendly way. I think she thought we could be something else. That's why she reached out to Jesse. <laughs> just wanted to break us up. I mean, I definitely think that she's been hurt. I get that Megan is such a great friend and she's protective. <sighs> you know, 100% the friend was set up with a friend that obviously was going to come here and confront him no matter what. But I just love it, man, when, it, when, it, when, it, when, it, when, it, when a man starts off or the person who's been accused starts off by basically having that story ready. You cannot tell me that you was friendly, friendly with a female and you rejected her. And then for some bizarre reason, after rejecting her, she then decided to go reach out to your girl to break you up. I mean, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know all about the term of scorned women or a scorned woman. It can be a very dangerous thing. But unless you've actually initiated something romantic with this female, there's no way she's going to go out of her way to try and break you up with your girl if you didn't do anything with her. He's done something. He's done something, but my man is ready to defend himself to the bone. Okay, cool. Let's get it. Right after Jessica told me about this incident, I immediately dug into the social medias of the alleged mistress and her family and friends. I found some pictures that they had posted. I mean, listen, you when when <laughs> you know one 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 is forgotten or, or doesn't know that women are investigators. FBI, MI5, MI6, CSI. <laughs> the great detectives are women. From the time that they were on the cruise, and one seemed to be um, with them on their excursions. I had reached out to this girl's sister, and she. Can you imagine? She even went out of her way to reach out. To reach out. This is detective work on an all another level. He said that they were intimate. So he's lying to my face right now, and I don't take lying lightly. You don't have nothing to worry about. That just gets fine. <laughs> just give him that look like, boy, you're lying to me. Don't tell me my friend is fine when I know you're lying to me. I see through you. I have the proof. I've been in contact. I've been in contact, but right now she doesn't want to let it slip that she's been in contact with the family. She just wants to give him a fair warning that he better, you know, buck up his ideas because if he doesn't, oh, she's not going to be a very happy person. He just has to make sure that he is loyal to Jessica at all times. But I have my doubts. <laughs> I mean, of course you'd have doubts, you know what I mean? Given the fact that you're speaking to the source themselves in particular. I just want you to know that if you're ever unfaithful to Jessica, it won't be good for you. <laughs> Wait, let, let's just replay that one. Let's re, re, re rewind. When Amanda say was elect, let's say it. At all times. But I have my doubts. I just want you to know that if you're ever unfaithful to Jessica, it won't be good for you. His face, though. His face. When she delivers that, and then his face, my man looks shook. He's like, huh? Huh? I mean, right now he looks guilty. He, he's got that guilt look. He's got that look of like, maybe I did that dibble dabble a little bit. Maybe the friend knows more than I'm, more than I realize that she knows because she's coming in with a threat like that. That's dangerous. But yo, man, like this show, they, they, need, they need to calm down with the threats. Johan was threatening Daniel the whole bloody season. You know what I mean? Now we've got, the Megan fled, uh, um, threatening your hand, like, I mean, I mean one, sorry. <laughs> I mean, listen, at the end of the day, for me personally, based on, based on the fact that this girl reached out to tell Jessica that she had been in one, <clears throat> tells me that for about 80 to 90% chance that he did cheat. That's what it tells me personally. Yeah. But at the same time, though, I like one. I, 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 you know, I want him and Jessica to work out. You know what I mean? I want them to work out, you know, especially given the fact that they've got a baby coming along the way too. But uh, if I'm one now, I'm going to be myself. Whenever, whenever, whenever wife is calling, pick up the phone ASAP. If you're in the middle of a ship, you still pick it up. <laughs> but I ain't going to lie to you. At the same time, though, I want to see what happens if he messes up. What happens? Though? I want to see what the friend is going to do to him if he does cheat. 
Yo, hey, yo, I, I, one, please go and cheat, please, so we can see what the friend does. <laughs> but sadly, well, not sadly, but fortunately, that doesn't happen because, uh, you know, uh, Jessica has given birth to their, to, to their child now in, in real time. And good congratulations to the couple. But um, I want to know what you guys are thinking. Let me know what you're thinking in the comment section. Do you think that he did cheat? Or do you think that nah, he didn't cheat? Let me know what you're thinking down below. And we'll talk about it. Don't forget to like, sub, and of course. Oh.